Well, just north of the metro in Cambridge, there is a wedding and a birthday celebration happening all in one. Yeah, the couple only got together five and a half months ago, but as they say, when you know, you know. And if their story is anything, it is unexplainable. They have actually known each other a really long time. Here's Fox 9's Rose Schmidt. This is a special day for Joshua and for Elizabeth. It's not a coincidence that these guests were brought together under this canopy of trees, witnessing a beautiful celebration of love. Marriage is, is like an umbrella that covers and, and protects love. But on this sunny Wednesday afternoon, you may look at Joshua and Elizabeth and find yourself believing some things are beyond coincidences. Last spring they met on a, on a, a dating app and they found, they found out all of these interesting things. Things like they both attended the same Christian school in Blaine, Elizabeth for just one year, kindergarten. And confirmed, yes, we graduated the same year. So I asked him what teacher he had, and he said he had the same exact teacher as I had. Elizabeth not only managed to find a class photo, but video from their graduation, where her mom happened to zoom in on Joshua. And when she looked him up online, the coincidences just kept coming. I see. 9-13-88 and I'm like oh my goodness that is so bizarre that is my birthday. Yes they were born on the same day in the same year at the same Coon Rapids Hospital. Really we we're on the same in the same room the day we were born and it's just fitting that we no, get married 35, 35 years, later. years later we're getting married on our birthdays so I think that's just pretty special. I am so blessed to call you my wife <clears throat> and best friend I love you forever. If you thought exchanging vows on a Wednesday was unusual, some things can be explained, but others might be beyond that. You couldn't make it up if you if you wanted to. I mean, I tell people, yeah, our, our, our uh, Hallmark movie comes out this fall. They both had separate life experiences, with Joshua serving in Iraq and Elizabeth raising her two children. But they believed the stars aligned so they could connect at the right time. It was love at first sight. Uh, she walked through the door and I'm like, that, that's her. And I knew right away. They even managed to track down their kindergarten teacher and invite her to the wedding. It's a story of serendipity, second chances, and a couple who brings a new meaning to the words day one. And now we're able to be with each other until our last day. In Cambridge, Rose Schmidt, Fox 9. <laughs> I mean, it. the story is just so perfect. It, it really so is. Many ways. Rose said there were so many coincidences she couldn't even fit them all <laughs> into the story, so I encouraged her to put them online. But she said his his middle name is Alan. Her dad's name is Alan. Yeah. I mean, it just goes on yeah. and on. So. The, the universe kept trying to put them together, <laughs> yes. and finally, at finally. 35, they found each other. Oh, congratulations. Well, the Vikings.